On the sports side, the local qualifier for the U.S. Open Golf Tournament now underway at the Troy Country Club. And John Craig has been there since the crack of dawn. He joins us now live with the latest. And John, uh, I expected to see you out there trying to get in yourself, no? Well, Jerry, I was hoping that there'd yeah. be an opening and I could sneak <laughs> in, you know, a little bit. That yep. would be that would be good, right? But nevertheless, uh, it's a closed field. They've already got it. About 50 guys are out there. In fact, the uh, final threesome went out just a short time ago, and they're making their way around here in this track. And hopefully, because we haven't had anybody in a long, long time make it, hopefully, get eventually to the U.S. Open. Golfers from around the region, including eight from Canada, with rain suits and winter hats, California dreaming of the U.S. Open at Pebble Beach. I've been playing four, five, six days a week, so, you know, definitely more prepared than most guys in this area. Brian Bigley of Rotterdam is a veteran of these qualifiers. The Chalmont and Siena product is now 34 years old and on the Web.com tour, the minor leagues of the PGA. He's been through these qualifiers before, but never made it to the U.S. Open. It's like a Monday qualifier for the tour. You know, you go out and have a good week and you can change your life. You know, so it's, uh, we'll see what happens. It's the National Open. It's, it's open to our best golfers, whether we're pro or amateurs. And it's a, it's a level playing field. When we get out here, we're just looking for the best golfers. If you get through here, it's onto a 36-hole sectional before a chance at the Open. Dan Cardella was an assistant pro here at Troy for 10 years and is now the GM. It's fun to think about, you know, and, and it could keep you up at night. But uh, right now, you know, I, I know that these guys and, and myself, we just think about that first step. We'd love to see one of our own people end up out there. Um, but there's, you know, there's a number of gentlemen from across the country playing in this. It's chasing a little white ball and the dream of something bigger down the fairway. It's an interesting opportunity to be able to play with professionals and kind of test our game against theirs. And it's a lot of fun. I'm really excited. All of them are really excited from Florida to Pennsylvania, eight from Canada as well. Now, three will qualify to go to sectionals. That is 36 holes in one day. There'll be two alternates. If you get through that in a couple of weeks, then it's off to Pebble Beach. Jerry, back to you. All right, John, thanks. Maybe we'll look for you to be among them next year. Maybe. All right, we'll cross our fingers.